Time for books. So cuddle up to mum or dad and let's rock and read. Today I'll be reading you Luli and the language of tea. And this is how it goes. The playroom was quiet. Lulu couldn't speak English. Neither could the others. All around the room, children played alone. Last time, Lulu had played by herself too, until she had an idea. She'd drawn it for Miss Hurricane. This time, Lulu had a plan. From inside her backpack and onto the round table, Lulu set a thermos, a canister, stacks of cups and a fat belly teapot. Out of the canister and into the teapot, Lulu dropped a small ball of tea leaves. Plop! Out of the thermos and over the tea leaves, Lulu poured steaming hot water. Plush! Lulu took a deep breath. Cha! She called in Chinese. All around the room, heads popped up. Che? asked Maxim in Russian. Chachai? Anya said in Hindi. Chachai? asked Karim in Turkish. Chachi? Nikau said in Persian. Che? asked Hakim in Arabic. Che? Valentina said in Spanish. Asked Matthias in German. Chachai? Cheshire said in Swahili. Cha? Asked Pedro in Portuguese. The tea was ready. Lulu beamed. Lulu beamed. She was ready. Cha! She beckoned. All around the room, children joined together. Lily poured the first cup and gave it to Maxim, who gave it to Anya and Maya, who gave it to Karen, who gave it to Nicole, who gave it to Hakim, who gave it to Valentina, who gave it to Matthias, who gave it to Tashala, who gave it to Pedro. All around the children, all around the table, children passed tea. Everyone had a full cup, except Luli. Pedro took Luli's empty cup and passed it to Tishala, who passed it to Matthias, who passed it to Valentina, who passed it to Hakim, who passed it to Nicole, who passed it to Karen. Who passed it to Anya? Who passed it to Maxim? Who passed it to Luli? Oh, they were sharing. All around the table, each child gave a little tea. Now everyone had a share. Hands curled around warm cups. Mouths curved into shy smiles. Lulu took another deep breath and pulled out one last surprise. She held up a box and spoke in her new favourite word in English. Cookie? The playroom was no longer quiet. And remember kids, remind mum and dad to subscribe so you can see all my books. Lulu's teapot was empty, but her heart was full. Wow.
Thank you for joining me to read Lulu, Luli and the Language of Tea. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next time.